In this tutorial video, we will get familiar with plant kingdom. Organisms who are eukaryotic, multicellular, chlorophyll containing and having cell wall are grouped under the kingdom plantae. It is popularly known as plant kingdom. Plant kingdom has been further classified into cryptogam. They are plants without seeds and phanerogam. They are plants with seeds. Phylogenetic system of classification based on evolutionary relationship is presently used for classifying plants. Numerical taxonomy use computer by assigning code for each character and analyzing the features. Cytotaxonomy is based on cytological information like chromosome number, structure and behavior. Chemotaxonomy uses chemical constituents of plants to resolve the confusion. First is algae. These include the simplest plants which possesses undifferentiated or thallus-like forms Reproductive organs single-celled called comitangia. It includes only algae. Characteristics of algae. Plant body is thallus which may be unicellular, colonial, filamentous or parenchymatous. Usually aquatic but a few are also found in moist terrestrial habitats like tree trunks wet rocks, moist soil and many more. Next is bryophytes. They are non-vascular mosses and liverworts that grow in moist shady region. They are called amphibians of plants kingdom because these plants live on soil but dependent on water for sexual reproduction. Characteristic features live in damp and shady habitats, found to grow during rainy season on damp soil, rocks, walls. The dominant phase or plant body is free living gametophyte. Roots are absent but contain rhizodoids. Next are gymnosperms. Gymnosperms are those plants in which the ovules are not enclosed inside the ovary wall and remain exposed before and after fertilization. They are perennial and woody forming either bushes or trees. Some are very large and others are very small. Stem may be unbranched or branched. Root is taproot. Leaves may be simple or compound. Gymnosperms are heterosporous, produce haploid microspore and megaspore in male and female strawberry respectively. Male and female gametophytes do not have independent free living existence. Pollination occurs through air and zygote develops into embryo and ovules into seeds and these seeds are naked. Go through this figure. It is an example of gymnosperms. Next is angiosperms. Pollen grain and ovules are developed in specialized structure called flower. Seeds are enclosed inside the fruits. Size varies from almost microscopic wolfia to tall tree eucalyptus. The male sex organs in a flower is the stamen. It contains pollen grain. The female sex organs in a flower is the pistil or the carpel. Pistil consists of an ovary enclosing one or many ovules. Within ovules are present highly reduced female gametophytes termed embryo sacs. 
I hope that now after watching this video you are quite familiar with Plan Kingdom and their basic characteristics. For detailed lesson of the same topic please log on to our website www.syft.in. Till then thank you very much for watching us.